Check one, two. <laughs> Y'all, welcome back to Music Cash Weekly. Wow, that was You're good. Ready, I'm ready. You're more ready than I am, I think. I'm your host, Fernando, <laughs> with three R's, and this is. Hi, everyone. I'm Jackie, and today we have a incredible show for you. We have performances, we got all the good stuff. You don't want to miss it. But first, it's time for question of the day. Yes. You guys submit questions every day asking about Music Cash, and today we have a question for you guys. Yes, sorry, sorry. Hold on here. Yeah, I don't know how to do this. You do that. Okay, I, I got your back. I got your back. <laughs> okay. She's a social media expert. So it looks like Susan Samantha, what, Susan Simon says she wants to know how to submit your actual contest video after submitting your profile on Music Cash. Wait, so you Very have. Very good question. You have your Music Cash account, okay? And when you have to record your video on YouTube, okay, that's very, very important. Yes. You, ha you have to do that, okay? So you have the link ready to go. You go to your profile, click my contest videos, okay? And then a form will come up and you have to click join contest for the current elimination round, okay? Yeah. Now, another form will pop up with your title, your description of the video, and that's where you can drop that YouTube link and then submit the video. You can only do this once and it cannot be deleted. Absolutely. They're no se puede, all right? Once you uploaded that video, it cannot be deleted. If you delete your profile, all your votes will go away. Yeah. So please, please, this is a very important part. And I, I saw a lot of responses too. They wanted to know between the video tab and the contest video tab, that's super important as well. You could upload right. separate videos so that people can get to know you a little bit more, show your personality, different music videos, but the music contest video, that is the one that you're submitting for the contest just to clarify so you know the difference between the two. That's and super important. Go to the video rules on musiccash.com so you don't get disqualified, so you don't get reported. You have to make sure you follow those rules, okay? All to right. the letter. Now time to introduce you to our guest for this episode of Music Cash Weekly. She's in fact going to be submitting to the Music Cash competition tonight. That's so what we I'm wish her the about. best of luck. Yes. And we can't wait for her to sing Waitlist for us here in the studio. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Katie, Katie Ferrara. <laughs> we did that good. That was, was that okay? That was so did good. we do that right? Yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Have a seat. Come on Thank over. You. How are you today? I'm good. Thanks You're... for having me on the show. Are you kidding? We are excited, and you look beautiful. Thank you. She has a new single coming out, Jackie. Okay, let's hear about it. What's it called? Um, my single's called Weightless, uh -huh. and uh, it's gonna be on Spotify, iTunes, um, all over the internet, and on uh, February 22nd is when it comes out. And I have a show coming up at the Hotel Cafe on uh, February 20th um, to celebrate its release. Oh, yay! Tell us about the song. What is the song about? Um, the song is about kind of giving up your stress and the feeling of oh, yes. nothing that can bring you down. Um, the song. Yeah. I'm, I'm all about meditation <laughs> and musa <laughs> and just like headspace. Right. I don't touch my ears a lot. but It's supposed to relax you. I love oh, that. It's, supposed to, it's a very uplifting song. Wait. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Um, we need more of that right now. You need, yeah, we need more positive songs. I feel like I've seen a lot and I have a lot of experience to share with people, Ooh. and I think that flows into the music a lot. That's well, awesome. Let's talk about that. Well, yeah, I mean, because our Music Cash is all about building that community to help each other out. So, I mean, you said you have a lot of experience. What's something that you, what's some advice that you would give to, you know, an up and coming artist that's trying to break it into the industry? Um, I would say just, just don't give up because it's really easy to, you know, get down on yourself. Um, I would just, you know, keep working on your craft. I think that's the most important thing. The music at the end of the day is when it's what is going to make you stand out from the crowd. You can reach so many people on Facebook, on YouTube, right. on your Instagram stories, but I feel like some artists, correct me if I'm wrong, are kind of in, maybe embarrassed or like don't think that's like the right route. They want to be like completely professional first before you know, putting a video out, but I've seen a lot of artists that, you know, kind of humble out a little bit yeah. and post something on Instagram or YouTube and it could go viral. I know, it's, it's crazy because I, I feel like, well, it's so easy to compare yourself to other artists and you see right. how farther along other people are and you think, well, I can't post anything if this other person is posting these really polished videos, but right. you have no idea, like, you know, they might be in debt spending all this money trying to make these videos and then you have like these people, they just, 
They write a song in their pajamas and they throw it up on <laughs> Instagram. Have you done that? Yeah, I've done that. Yeah. <laughs> I knew I knew it. I had a feeling. You know, but you have to start somewhere. That's of what I'm course. saying. Like, and, and, and people like to see that, that story, especially on Instagram, mm -hmm. especially on YouTube and all the live streaming sites. Um, people love to see humility and they, they, they like to know the artist from the beginning and they, they like to get to know the artist. And when you just post something that's very polished up, it's you have this disconnect. Yeah, yeah, it's not authentic. We were talking about the Music Cash profiles and how important it is to share yeah. your story. And there's a lot of different ways you could do that on the Music Cash profile. We're so excited for your submission. Yay. First of all, yeah, do upload all your photos and videos. And then the My Contest tab is what you're going to click in order to submit your video once you record it tonight. And then that link, you're going to drop it into that My Contest video. So tell your story. Katie, yeah. Tell it. it. <laughs> yeah, be it's, proud. Be loud. Right. It's so important, like you were saying, to build that connection with your audience. I mean, music, obviously, is one side in the talent, but people want to connect with the artists and get to know them. So it is important for you guys to put out those videos, the, the bio, let us know who you are. We want to know who you are. Especially in that description, you'll have the title, you put your name, the song, if it's a cover or original, right? And then underneath, um, you can definitely write the story of what the song is about, where you're from, how long you've been singing, you know, it'll be right in there in your submission video. So what would you do with $40,000? Um, with forty thousand dollars, I just create a lot of music. Yeah. I would, I would, you know, go into the studio and I would invest the money into just making music for people, um, and maybe like teaming up with a cause. I think you know that's really important in like, the age that we live in is, mm -hmm. is to um, pair music up with something that you're really passionate about. So I, I feel like you know if I had that investment power I could invest in something that I'm also very passionate about you know Sweet. You're, no, that. you're amazing <laughs> well, we love for you to come back all right folks and now it's time to play spell that instrument you guys ready yeah. are you I, good at spelling no <laughs> no I'm not I'm terrible but I'm excited I like playing games period I, are you good at spelling I hope so oh geez <laughs> I self sabotage myself because I'm not good at spelling either. But oh boy. since I'm the host, <laughs> I don't have to spell. Oh. <laughs> You're the two finalists of our Music Cash Spelling Bee and the first word. Raise your hand if you know it. <laughs> I don't really have anything here. <laughs> <laughs> spell to you, Katie, since you're our guest. Oh, We're yes. changing the rules on the spot. Okay. Ukulele. Oh, geez. Oh. Um, I mean, not, oh, I mean you. <laughs> <laughs> that was the response. You're like, oh, that the word, not, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You have to we'll say. let that pass, we'll let that pass. <laughs> it's like, eh, you're out. Do you remember spelling, but you have to say the word first oh, and then spell it. There you go, okay, go. Nice. Okay. Ukulele. U, <laughs> K, U, L, E, L, E. Yay, that's correct! Woo! That was actually got it. good. It's actually spelled the way that it's pronounced, but people say it wrong. It's ukulele, so of course, it's easier when you say it the right way to spell oh, it the right aloha. way. Oh, aloha! Look at her! Been to Hawaii a couple times. Okay, now I'm gonna put you on the spot. Oh no! This is your word. Gosh, I'm about to butcher it. I already know. Okay, ready? Yeah. All right, and remember, you have to say the word and then spell and then yes. say the word. Yes. And you can ask for a sentence if you want. Oh, okay, great. All right, here we go. Timpani. I don't even know what a timpani is. Is that an instrument? Is oh it, my it's, goodness. It's like a, in the percussion family. You got like the hardest oh, one. What is a timpani? The, the it's okay. like this round things. It's they have drum. different, um, yeah, it's a drum. Uh, Fernando, can I have that in a sentence, please? Okay. <laughs> I don't like to play the timpani in the marching band because it weighs a lot. Okay, All right. Timpani, T, I, P U N I Tiffany. <laughs> <laughs> I butchered it, right? There's probably like seven other there letters. There wasn't in even there. an M there. Wait, you Tim. Said, oh, it's Tim. I thought it was Tiffany. Oh, Tiffany. Tim. There's an M there. It's M P U N I. Okay. We'll find out, Katie. Do you know? <laughs> I actually don't know. We should ask Siri. Oh, Siri, how do you spell <laughs> Timpani? Okay, I'm glad go. I'm not alone on this one. Okay, here we go. All right. Okay, let's ask her. How do you spell Timpani? There are two words pronounced like that. T-I-M-P-A-N-I or T-Y-M-P-A-N-I. 
M P A N Y. Symphony, Timphony. So yeah, I think the close. first one is right. Yeah. Timphony. T I M. Pedal drums. P mm -hmm. A N I. <laughs> So I was close, you were replaced close. the U with an A and put that M in there. And I was M like, I almost, I almost got it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, does anyone have a, 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 an instrument for me to spell? Or right at the top of their head? Yes, okay. xylophone. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right? A back, A back. 2019 girl power, Ariana Grande, hashtag. Oh my God, okay, all right. <clears throat> Xylophone. X, Y, L, O, P, H, O, N, E. Xylophone. I doubt it's spelled like actual phone. <laughs> <Hold on. laughs> hey Siri, how do you spell xylophone? Xylophone. X, Y, L. -O Dang, I really thought I was gonna stump you on that one. Zyphone. But let's be real, he's the one that came up with the game, so he probably knows all how all these words are spelled. I Googled Did it. you cheat? No, no, I am the judge. A judge cannot cheat. Okay. A judge can never lose. Good job. That was actually that was actually really good. You Thank you, that was so good. Kudos to you. That was awesome. Now I know you're gonna be playing the guitar today. Speaking of instruments, do you play any other ones? Uh, I play a little bit of piano. Um, I started writing on the piano actually really recently because I want to get better. I, I've always played guitar for most of my life, but I think trying to write on different instruments is good. It opens up your songwriting. That's true. So, Are you uh, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. I want to know if she knows how to spell guitar, though. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm totally I'm kidding. I'm totally kidding. <laughs> Spelling bee's over. Spelling bee's over. We're done. We got to move on to this <laughs> performance of yes. Weightless. Katie Ferrara's uh, new single coming out. Have fun. Thank you. Enjoy. I'm so it's excited. It's going to be a weightless perform. performance. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, right now, please welcome Katie Ferrara. Go ahead and take the stage, Katie. Applauso!
Bravo! Come on back! Thank you so much. Thank that you. was so good. Oh. That was incredible. Thank you. Well, have a seat. Let's say bye to uh, yeah. everyone at home. Cool. And first of all, good luck. Thank you. You know, um, Music Cash. And we're so excited. You could win forty thousand dollars, but if you don't win, you could win twenty. Yeah. Second place or third place, at least eighty eight thousand dollars. Yeah. I mean, over three hundred people are gonna win some cash. All right. It's, it's, it's all in her face. She's excited. She's I'm so really excited. excited yeah. So, folks, submit your videos to musiccash.com. It's free until March 1st. After that, there's going to be a small service fee. And start telling your friends and family to vote for you on this season of Music Cash. Thanks for tuning in to Music Cash Weekly. I'm Fernando with three R's. And I'm Jackie Idenisi. And this was Katie Ferrara. Yes. With two R's. Yes, only two R's. <laughs> All right, folks, we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Ciao. Ciao. Thank you so much. Yay, thank, thank you so much. We're supposed to be done. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you know it's like this. Hey. <laughs> it's the cutest.